The best digital cameras for photography haven't forgotten their photography roots. Although cameras these days may be increasingly focusing on video, there are some seriously impressive new contenders with much improved autofocusing and burst shooting skills. So, if you're looking for a solid stills camera, you have plenty of excellent options. After researching the market, we have come up with the top 5 best digital cameras from the market. They will do what they are intended for and some more. So without further ado, let's start with the video. And don't forget to check the product link in the description. Number 1. Sony Alpha 7 IV. The Sony Alpha 7 IV is one of the best enthusiast cameras you can get. It's a fantastic option for hybrid shooters who want a camera that can do it all, from portraits and landscapes to high-quality video work. The camera itself is super well-built, with a weather-sealed body, a fully articulated touchscreen, and a high-res electronic viewfinder. Inside is a 33-megapixel full-frame sensor that gives you plenty of leeway to crop and edit. Add in built-in sensor stabilization, internal 10-bit 4K 60 frames per second recording, no recording time limits, and a battery life that outlasts most of the competition, and this is one of the most versatile cameras in its price range for video work as well as photos. If the handling and feel of a camera are important to you, you can also take a look at the Canon EOS R6. Despite its lower resolution sensor, it's very evenly matched with the Sony for photography, with even faster raw burst shooting. Still, the Sony has a slight edge for hybrid or video shooters thanks to its better battery performance and heat management. It isn't the most portable camera either. 4K frame rate options are also a bit limited for action video since it can't record at high frame rates in 4K and can only shoot 4K 60 frames per second with a large 1.5x crop. It is IBIS and does a good overall job smoothing out camera shake, but you still need a gimbal to get smooth action footage. Number 2. Canon EOS R7. The Canon EOS R7 is a mirrorless camera tailor-made for photographers who want to capture sports, wildlife, and other subjects that call for fast, accurate autofocus. And the R7 excels at identifying people, pets, wildlife, and race cars. The 32.5 MP APS-C format image sensor matches well with telephoto lenses, offers plenty of resolution for crops, and supports 4K 60 video for cinema and vlogs. Weather protected, magnesium construction makes the R7 a camera you can take out into the world. The R7 is a good fit for photo enthusiasts and pros alike, especially those with an eye for action photography and a need for 15 frames per second subject tracking. As a main camera, the R7 is versatile enough for landscape and studio work, too, while video is an option for cinema projects. Family photographers may miss a built-in flash, however, and should look at the EOS R10 or Fujifilm X-T32 instead. A high-resolution sensor with 5-axis IBIS and support for 4K 60 video rounds out its feature set. Although its image sensor doesn't wow us like the high-end EOS R3, from which the R7 derives its autofocus acumen, nearly everything else about the camera does. It's the model to get if you've been waiting for a mirrorless update to the 7D Mark II. In light of all its strengths, the R7 displaces the Fujifilm X-T4 as our editor's choice winner in the premium crop sensor class. The Canon EOS R7 brings the heat to competing APS-C cameras with its fast and accurate autofocus and flexible video tools, making it a fine choice for photographers and videographers alike. Number 3. Olympus Tough TG6. The Olympus Tough TG6 is the last high-quality tough camera standing, thankfully, it's good enough to earn our enthusiastic recommendation. The pocket-friendly snapshot cam is built to withstand drops and high-pressure environments, with a 50-foot underwater rating. The zoom lens is a bright f2 at the wide end with a 24mm angle for divers, and we especially love the option to add a macro light for close-up work. 
For many, a tough camera is one you take with you when don't want to risk destroying your smartphone the TG6 fits the bill and manages good picture quality to boot. The TG6 is the camera to get if you're a thrill seeker, outdoors enthusiast, or recreational diver in want of a pocketable, hard to destroy digital camera. It's our top recommendation if your eye is slanted towards still images over video, and especially if you love macros, the TG6 is a great close-up camera. Video fans chasing the POV look should opt for a GoPro Hero 10 Black instead. Year after year, model after model, Olympus has bested all other competition with its flagship waterproof TG series. It's a pocketable camera with a lens that makes it a decent low-light option, and a waterproof design rated to 50 feet. There aren't a lot of other waterproof cameras on the market these days, and while the TG6 doesn't offer huge gains over the TG5, it's still the best waterproof point-and-shoot you can get, and our editor's choice. The Olympus Tough TG6 is a modest update to our favorite underwater point-and-shoot camera thanks to its tough design, bright lens, and excellent macro capabilities. Number 4. Fujifilm X-T32 There's more to the Fujifilm X-T32 than a head-turning, retro-inspired design. The camera sports a 26MP APS-C format sensor, boasts face and eye detection focus for people, and offers 8 frames per second mechanical and 20 frames per second electronic shutters for high-speed snaps. A fully realized lens system is another plus, you can pick from a broad range of prime and zoom lenses, from Fuji. Sigma and Tamron recently started offering lenses for the system, too. Despite its photo-enthusiast-pleasing retro aesthetics, we see the X-T32 as a camera for family photographers and enthusiasts alike. Beginners can engage auto mode and snap great looking JPGs using any number of creative film simulation looks and record 4K30 video. Advanced amateurs and pros can use manual controls or raw capture. We don't like this one as much for outdoor photogs and hikers, though, consider stepping up to the weather sealed Fuji X-T4 or Canon EOS R7 if you plan to venture out in rough weather. The new edition features upgraded memory that unlocks support for a few new imaging processing features but, otherwise, it's the same camera that earned our editor's choice. The X-T32 isn't as groundbreaking as its predecessor because the landscape is more competitive now, but it's still among the best you can get for the price and worthy of our editor's choice award. A well-populated X lens system doesn't hurt matters either. The Fujifilm X-T32 is just a slight update to one of our highest-rated cameras. Fuji could have done more, but it still remains one of our favorite affordable interchangeable lens cameras. Number 5. Panasonic Lumix S5. The Panasonic Lumix DC-S5 is one of the more affordable full-frame cameras available and we especially like its extra-wide 20-60mm kit zoom which is particularly useful for cityscapes, landscapes, and vlogs. For the price, it's also hard to beat the full-frame 24MP photos and 10-bit 4K, we really love the way the S5 handles, too. On the downside, its L-mount lens system isn't as fully formed as rivals Canon or Sony. Its contrast detection focus system isn't as good for action shots as alternatives that rely on phase detection, either. If you're looking to make vlogs and want the full-frame look, the S5 is a solid starting platform. Its front-facing screen, 5-axis sensor stabilization, and 10-bit 4K are all marks in its favor. For photography, the picture quality is excellent, and a 96MP multi-shot mode is an option for landscape, architectural, and macro specialists. For action, the 6 frames per second tracking focus system is limiting, though, so think about a fast crop sensor camera like the EOS R7, or a mid-range full-framer like the Sony A7 IV if you need more speed. Panasonic went big with its first-generation Lumix DCS1 full-frame mirrorless camera, both in size and price, positioning it around $2,500, toward the high end of the range for a 24MP model. It's targeting a more entry-level market with the Lumix DC-S5, but instead of cutting back on features, the S5 is a bit more capable, offering improved video features and better autofocus. It's a great entry point for full-frame imaging, and a winner of our Editor's Choice Award.